Quantronic. This name stands for a new therapy system. It uses the power of electromagnetic fields. The entire universe and all of life are full of electromagnetic fields. Next to the typical electrical properties, every charge has additional magnetic effects. Vice versa, every magnetic change leads to an electrical reaction. Electrical currents and therefore magnetic fields can also be found in the human body. They control our basic functions. This influence has been known for a long time and used in early medicine. The first known records go back to 16th century scientist Paracelsus. The 19th century scientist and doctor Franz Anton Mesmer is considered to be the founder of magnetic therapy. Quantronic stands for Quantum Physic Cybernetic Therapy. The developer's goal was to find a way to use the healing power of electromagnetic fields. But those fields can also be harmful to the human body. Getting a healing effect without side effects, that was one of the basic problems the scientists had to face. The long years of research and development led to a new system. It works with pulsating magnetic fields, with low field strengths and low frequencies the quantum resonance system, QRS. What sounds so easy was in fact a major breakthrough in magnetic field therapy. Based on this theory, scientists develop a new device. It can be used in preventive medicine as well as for therapies. Any device that is used for preventive medicine has to be easy to handle. In this case, the device was designed for doctors as well as for private use. It therefore has to meet a high standard in safety and usability. The CE Hallmark, a certificate for medical equipment issued by the European community, guarantees this standard. In addition, every single device has to undergo a final test by the manufacturer. One important criteria for this test is the Quantronic signal. It has to meet the exact specifications. What is so special about the quantum resonance system? Es unterscheidet sich von herkömmlichen Magnetfeldtherapien vor allen Dingen durch drei Dinge. There are three things that distinguish it from conventional magnetic field therapies. It doesn't work with single frequencies, but rather with frequency patterns that are equivalent to those of the body. Compared to other magnetic field therapy devices, this one uses neither sinus, rectangular or trapezium waves. It uses a precisely defined waveform. We call it the double sawtooth. But the most important thing is, this device works with a very low magnetizing force in the range of 0.5 to 10 microtesla, equivalent to the human body. You've decided to try the quantum resonance therapy. I'll just explain the system. This is the control device and underneath you is a mat with magnetic spools. We'll now turn on the device. We can choose between 10 different field strengths. In our case, I'll just set it to level 6. The panel now induces a pulsating magnetic field in your body. This improves the metabolism, the oxygen pressure is slightly increased, therefore calcium is transported into the cell. The so-called calcium cascade is triggered, which also improves your body's immune system. In some cases you should use the cushion instead of the mat. The cushion is placed wherever you need it, for example right here, in case you have problems with your knee joint. You can use the color panel to help you choose the correct field strength. In this case level 7 lies within the biological framework of the patient. Level 7 
The magnetic field will affect your entire body, but it will cause an increased stimulation where the cushion is placed. Fifty percent of the energy formed inside a cell is used to uphold a sufficient membrane potential. That is the tension of the cell's membrane. This leads to a loss of energy inside the cell. The oscillation of a magnetic field can compensate this loss. It revives the metabolic processes inside the cell. The result? An improved energy balance with all its positive effects. Due to the low magnetizing force, the quantum resonance system works without side effects. There is no risk except for people with electronic implants. Also, we recommend that pregnant women don't use this device since during a pregnancy the metabolism is on a very high level anyway. 